Coming home to a clean house is something we all enjoy, but it's especially meaningful to Karen Rothy. It's such a great feeling to walk through the rooms and just go, oh, you know, one less thing on my plate. Cleaning is at the bottom of Karen's priority list as she was diagnosed with uterine cancer in January. And the first thing that came to my mind was that I wouldn't see my children graduate from high school. And then I called my husband to come home. And I, I think when I heard him crying, then I started crying. Through her nurse, Karen learned about cleaning for a reason. This organization finds free house cleaning services for women going through cancer treatment. So when she handed me that paper, I was like, oh my gosh, it was the holy grail. <laughs> it was wonderful. The maids are a part of cleaning for a reason. Each month, they clean the home of two female cancer patients, and they keep helping those women for four months. It's a great way to give these stressed out women that are fatigued to just take cleaning off of their plate so that they're feeling good about not having to clean and they can really focus on, on themselves. It was critical for Karen to live in a clean environment as she had a suppressed immune system while undergoing chemotherapy. We're also cleaning light switches and doorknobs, preventing germs and viruses, as well as showers and tubs, preventing mold and mildew. As Karen has completed chemo and is hoping for a bright future, the maids get ready to help another woman and make a difference, one home at a time. In Elm Grove, Laura Langamo, Fox 6 News.